Let me explain the difference between Islamic and Christian eschatology. Eschatos is the study of last things. It's what happens in the end. Islamic eschatology is this, that Islam will eventually rule the entire earth, every nation. Islam has no separation of church and state. They rule through the Quran and Sharia law. And it is not a religion of proposition. Christianity is a religion of proposition. Will you repent of your sin and receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior? It is not a religion of proposition. It is a religion of imposition. Convert or die. It's jihad, holy war. So they believe that Islam will rule the world. And, and let me say, there are nations that are Islamic and they are ruled by the Quran. There's actually right now in Detroit, an entire neighborhood that is ruled by the Quran and Sharia law and the police won't even go into. Wherever Islam gets a foothold, it becomes a stronghold. That's why they had to shut down the streets in France. They're like, well, our laws say you can't behave this way. Like, we, we don't regard your laws. We're not, we're not honoring your nation. We don't believe in your religion. We don't even tolerate it. We wanna dominate it, eradicate it. And their eschatology is that Islam will take over the globe. This is why they keep having children, moving into nations and having lots of children while Westerners um, castrate their children and abort their babies. See, they have the long view of things. If we can just get people into the future, we can rule the future. And the goal ultimately is twofold, that when they bring complete and total domination of the world, they will rule with an iron fist. It'll bring about a peace that will then allow a king to rise up and rule the world as his kingdom, their king. This is the Antichrist. We'll get into this when we get into the next book of the Bible in 2 Thessalonians. This may be the man of lawlessness. It's a counterfeit. Jesus said, that's my planet and I'm coming to be the king and bring shalom peace. And then suddenly there is this counterfeit that comes into being. And that is that there would be another king and another kingdom. Here's what the senior Hamas official Mahmoud al-Zahar says. Here's what he says they are doing. We need to stop and pray. Somebody just passed out. Let's just pray for them and then I'll continue. Father God, we pray for healing for whatever just happened in the back of the room. We pray against the spirit of Hamas. We pray for the presence of the Holy Spirit. Lord God, somebody came here to hear the word of God and they just passed out. I don't know what's going on. I pray for medical help. I pray for their healing in Jesus' name. And if this be any spirit but the Holy Spirit, we say the Lord rebuke you in Jesus' name. This is the sermon we put on the internet. This is the sermon that goes out to nations. This is the sermon that this week, when I just verbal processed what I was going to say, a million people watched the clip, okay? I know you wanted to come to church, but it feels like we've come for battle. Here's what the senior Hamas official, Mahmoud al-Zahar says. We believe in what our prophet Muhammad said. Allah, that is the name of their demon God drew the ends of the world to one another for my sake, and I have seen its eastern and western ends. The dominion of my nation would reach those ends that have been drawn near me. The entire 510 million square kilometers of planet Earth shall come under a system where there is no injustice, no oppression, no Zionism, no Israel, no nation of Israel, no treacherous Christianity, and no killings, and crimes like those being committed against the Palestinians and against the Arabs and all the Arab countries and Lebanon, Syria, Iraq, and other countries. The one thing I do agree with them is this, this is a war between good and evil. This is not left versus right, this is good versus evil. And they're on the wrong side of the fight. Hey, howdy, Pastor Mark here. Thanks for viewing the clip. And if you'd like the entire sermon, we've got it ready to go. 